Hey gang, welcome back to Joe Daddy's Garage. Today I'm going to do some cutting with the plasma cutter, the Cut 55 DS from Yes Welder. Now, sometimes when you're doing a project, you may have to cut out some bad metal. Frequently when I'm doing an old Mustang or even a Camaro or any old car, I may have to cut out the floor pan or pieces of the quarter panel, and I can take the plasma cutter and cut those pieces out and it comes out great. Sometimes you need to fabricate patches for the same car. I've cut out rough cut with the plasma cutter to make patches, and I've also used material like this I have in front of me to fix up stuff like an old lawnmower. You know, you've got a rusted deck on the lawnmower and you want to keep using it, so you make a patch panel. Well, the plasma cutter is ideal for that, and I'm going to show you how to use it and make some cuts. All right, so I'm using the Cut 55 DS. Whenever you're using these, one thing I will point out, make sure you have at least a water separator on your plasma cutter. Air coming into this has moisture in it, and you want to make sure there's no moisture getting into your system. This thing needs to function on clean air. So get some good safety glasses. I use hearing protection and some gloves. Okay, so sometimes if you want to cut a nice straight line, I use a piece of square tubing, hold it against the metal. Now you may have to reference where your cut tip is so that you're comfortable with it, but you can use this as a guide against that piece of metal. So I'm going to start here in the back. End up with a nice straight cut. If you have to, you can address this down with a bit of a sanding disc, but you can see how easily it cut through that. All right, now you can see how to use that plasma cutter. By all means, keep safety in mind when you're doing this sort of thing. Safety glasses, ear protection, gloves. Make sure your feet aren't in an area where the sparks can land on your feet, because you'll be doing a funny dance if you do. So that's going to be it for this segment. Thanks for watching. Check me out on Joe Daddy's Garage.